seems all the rage these days is about this local figure that people are calling the Spider-Man. But what do we really know about this man? Is it a man at all? And what are his or her intentions? Some say he's here to protect, others point to the fact that he is present at almost every major crime scene as evidence that he must be against us. A menace in red tights. That's how the NYPD sees it. We know the city is already hard at work investigating and Mayor de Blasio is exploring all options. He's a bloody menace in this city. He has no respect for rules and laws, for God's sake. He should be in jail. One has to wonder, what does Spider-Man think of all this? Is he worried? Is he thriving off the attention? And where is he right now? Hello? Anybody there? Hey, look, whoever's there, I got a call saying there's some big punk terrorizing the neighborhood. Whoever you are, just come out. Can we make this quick? I don't go out all night. That call was from me. <laughs> That's good. That's ridiculous. Hold on, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I had to see a second. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> okay, you bad guys, you're really stepping up your costume game, huh? That's awesome, I love it. My crewmates might have fallen, but nobody takes down the rhino. And he's given himself a name, <laughs> and it's a creative one. You think yours is any better? Uh, it is. You don't see me going around calling myself the spider. Rhinos crush spiders. Sometimes, yeah, but not every time. <laughs> see? I think maybe spiders are underrated. Okay, I'll give you some points. You seem to have muscle under all that. Come here. Sorry, kids. I'm on the exhibit of course. Okay, that never happens. You wanna play dirty, huh? Let's play dirty. I'm done being Mr. Nice Guy. You tell your friends, when they waste my time, this is what they get from now on! You thought you were going to kill me, how you? on the tragic death of Harry Osborne, son of wealthy industrialist head of Osborne, Norman Osborne. 
who died three years ago at the hands of the Spider-Man. Now we've received information from reliable sources saying that Spider-Man was the perpetrator of Harry Osborn's death. There's an obvious pattern here, leading many to believe that these murders were no accident. It's a time of uncertainty, and one that the people of the city are not taking lightly. Some have already tried taking things into their own hands. Just today, Alexei Sitsevich, a member of the Russian mob, tried attacking Spider-Man with no luck. And Spider-Man is now wanted by the Chief of Police, Captain Stacy. This is the second time you failed me, Alexei. Third. You know you'd make up to be a terrible lawyer. You've been working for me for a long time now, Alexei. And you were my number one assassin. And I want to thank you for that, my friend. But I gave you one simple task. To bring the Spider-Man to me. And you couldn't even do that. Uh, he has amazing agility. I, I couldn't... Uh, amazing agility? You don't think the animals in this room have agility? What are you trying to say? That I'm a terrible hunter? I don't like being insulted, Alexei. You're hurting my shoulders, boss. Get out! Who's going to hunt the Spider-Man now? Why don't you hunt him yourself? <laughs> you know, you've always been known to be a smart man, Alexei. Maybe you're right. Maybe I could hunt after the Spider-Man myself. Yeah, see? You don't need me. <sighs> you're right. I don't need you. I'm the last man, you can't kill me! Shut up! <laughs> So the hunt begins. test or something? Uh, yeah, that's actually exactly what we have. Aren't you in my class? Oh, shit, yeah, well, I'm always failing anyways. It's a big year, Flash. Can't really be failing anymore. Since when do you care about me so much? Since when do you care about me caring? Hey, don't be smarter. I'll kick your ass again. Highly unlikely. Let me prove it. Uh, no, not the best time. <laughs> it's always a good time for a pounding. I'm gonna go. What? What are you laughing at? I gotta go. I'm gonna kick your ass, Parker. Parker! I know you're here, 
here somewhere. Nice to see my prey up close. What kind of costume is that? You look like Tarzan joined an 80s band. You don't like my jacket? This is my prize hunt. Leopard from South Africa. I was gonna forgive you for the spear in the knee, but you kill animals too. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, amazing, actually. Oh, okay. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Yeah, I like a challenge. Take out the trash. Uh. Have fun dumpster diving. Midtown High, here I come. Midtown High. Liz, you can't be scaring me like that. You scared me. You weren't answering your phone. Well, I'm a busy guy. What kind of crime is there at 8 in the morning? There's no crime, but you know, I slept in. What's with the suit? Well, I swung here, so it was a little bit faster to wear it. So you swung here and you were still late for the math test? Yeah, pretty much. <sighs> Don't worry. I I I'm Spider-Man. You have to stop worrying. You sound like Aunt May when you do that. And... Look, you could have wrote the math test, but I wouldn't be focused. So obviously it makes sense that I'm out here. There's no one as strong as me. You shouldn't be worrying the, about me like this. You know, I was worried sick. Hold on a second. Yeah, um, I have a problem. What? I forgot all my clothes. Again? Sick. Yeah, and my backpack, but, you know, just save me this one, one last time. You are so lucky you have me. I really am. All right, there's that. You have my shoes, too? Yes. How much time do you think we have? We don't have any time. We need to get in there and write the damn test. Ready? Yeah. Forget something? I don't know how I forgot that. You think we're gonna get in trouble? Well, I hope not. I don't think we're getting in trouble. We're not gonna get in trouble. You guys cannot be missing tests. I mean, I know your hormones are off the chain. Believe me, I went to high school too. But not for tests. This is your senior year. Do you know what that means? Oh, did you want us to actually respond to that? Yes. I thought it was a rhetorical question. Your senior year means every test counts. <laughs> Where are you guys going next year? Well, I actually have a science scholarship at Empire State University. Oh. <laughs> How did that happen? Um, I'm smart. Okay. And you, Liz? Where are you going? Oh, well, I'm not going to school. I'm actually going to LA to pursue acting, so... Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, 
I guess that means you can skip the math test. But, Peter, really, I don't know about you. You really what are you have talking to... about? I beg your pardon? Well, it, um, uh, it's just that I have an 85 in this class, right? So even if I got zero on this test, it would only drop me down 3%. Whatever. You're free to go. So good to see you. Likewise, my friend. Glad you could make it. So, what do you have for me? Ah, yes. The Oscorp serum. This stuff looks pretty potent. How did you get it? I stole it from Oscorp. <laughs> it's stronger than any steroid on the market. Be careful, man. It's some scary shit. Do I look scared to you? <laughs> if you don't mind me asking, what's it for? What do you think? I don't know. McBride, who am I? Craven. Craven. Craven the hunter. Exactly, but not just any hunter. I am the world's greatest hunter. And in order to be the world's greatest hunter, you have to kill the world's greatest prey. Who's that? The Spider-Man! The Spider-Man? Yeah. He's crazy? He's dangerous, he's been all over TV. He killed the Osborns. You know, McBride, there's a saying in my hometown in Russia. Venekutskis voyego poris den yo ubitsva. What does that mean? You're only as good as your last kill. So, if I kill the Spider Man, the people of this city will know of the name Craven, the Hunter. You're insane. Spider Man is extremely powerful. I am stronger! Okay, Craven. Good. I'm glad you understand. Thanks for the serum, McBride. Skodo ubisma. I will be seeing you soon. Where's my money? You'll get your money once the Spider-Man is dead! <laughs> uh, I'm not getting my money. Okay, what's on your mind? Where do I start? Maybe first of all the fact that Spider-Man is a wanted criminal. After three years of doing what I do, this is how the city repays me? It's like I did no good in the first place. And I feel crazy guilt about the Osbournes every day. I do, but I mean, what was I supposed to do? That was the most powerful chemical compound I've ever encountered. And if I didn't stop them earlier, they could have flipped the whole city upside down. Look, all we can hope for is that this serum never gets created again. Well, that's my fear. Because I think I found something worse. What is that? This is what made me bulletproof. The black suit. The black suit, yeah. I feel some sort of weird alien connection to it. Like whenever something bad happens, I feel a bond and that shouldn't happen. It's a liquid, but it does happen. And I don't know what to do. Should I bring it here to the science teachers at school? I don't think they're gonna know what it's all about. You talk too much, Peter. Maybe I should talk too much more often then. <laughs> hey! Mr. Cobwell? Yeah? What is it? There's a crazy jungle man in the school! Oh, maybe it's a drama kid? Oh my god! Oh my god! Definitely not a drama kid. Liz, you have to go. What? Just go. Good luck. Spider-Man, huh? Tell me now! 
You stop! And who might you be? Uh, just a student that goes here. That's all. Wait. I've heard that voice before. Uh, I do? No, no. I remember that face, too. No, look, dude, you're tripping. You, you're Peter Parker. The man who takes pictures for Spider-Man. Ah, uh, that's not me. You got, you got the wrong guy. Uh, that's creepy. <laughs> You're Spider-Man! <laughs> How'd you get so strong? Performance enhancers. Oh, of course. It was easy to find you. That's not gonna be easy to kill me. I know who you are! Holy moly! Spider-Man! That's why, huh? Yes! Spidey! Gene, tell me to watch it! Alright, get ready to go to the front page of the Daily Bugle! Oh man, Peter's gonna be so jealous! <laughs> Peter Parker, the Daily Bugle? No, no, no! I'm going to kill you, you blast! No, please! No, no! Hey, Chewbacca, no running in the hallways. You little bug, I will crush you! I want to see your pretty head! Found him! Put your hands in the air! Oh, Captain Stacy, to see. Freeze! Me? What? I'm the good guy. How can there be two bad guys? The city doesn't see you as a good guy, Spider-Man. Uh, man, just let me do my job. I don't get paid enough for this. I think this is a warning. doing well. I can see that. Um, Felicia, I'm in the same boat. Harry was my best friend, but I've gone through this before with Uncle Ben, and it gets better. I, I'm just gonna go. Look what you did. I can't keep doing this. What? What do you mean? All these deaths at the hands of you. What if I'm next? I'm sorry, I'm done. 
shot to see an old friend. Tell me, what's next? You let your uncle Ben get shot, then you murdered my dad. You failed to save Tim as he fell to his death. Then you go ahead and snap my neck. So who's next, huh? Aunt May? Mary Jane? What else are you gonna do? Who else has to go into the ground because of you? Everyone around you becomes a corpse. You're gonna let your entire family die! No! Oh my god! Oh, Peter, are you okay? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm fine, yeah, yeah. Why are you so tired today? Uh, I'm tired all the time. Today's no different. I heard about what happened at school today. Uh, yeah, it, it was fine though. I ran right out. I also heard that uh, Spider-Man showed up. Did you hear that? That's nice. Peter, I know. Um, you know? Yeah, I know that you're Spider-Man. <laughs> no, it, it could be anyone. It, no, no, it, stop, stop. I know. How? I found your suit a few months ago. And you didn't tell me? I didn't know what to think at first. Uh, and then I started putting two and two together. And then with everything that happened today, Peter, I I'm worried. That's a first. Honestly, I. how long has this been going on? Not long. Two, three years max. Years? And you didn't tell me? Well, how was I supposed to tell you? I got bit by the spider, garnered these powers, and Uncle Ben died soon after. There was no good time. Wow. I guess my life was crazier than I thought. I, I just, I don't understand why you didn't tell me. You used to tell me everything. I know, but I, I, I just, I mean, you're already worried sick about me as it is. Okay, point taken. And, and could you imagine I tell you that I have superhuman abilities? I mean, you would have had a heart attack for sure. Yeah, but at least then you wouldn't have been lying to me all this time. Look, it's not even so much that you didn't tell me. It's just that what you're doing is dangerous. It's a lot of responsibility. It's, it's inevitable. You're going to get hurt. No. Don't say no. The entire world is out to get you. Yeah, but only a small number of people are actually capable of it. Look, Uncle Ben used to tell me all the time that with great power comes great responsibility. And I feel like over the past three years, I've learned what he meant by that. Peter, I'm scared. Look, don't be scared. If anyone's unsafe, it's me, not you. I'm going to keep you safe. Okay, see, that doesn't make me feel any better because it's you I'm worried about. Again, I've been doing this for three years, so I think I've got the hang of it by now. Am I the only person who knows? Um, <laughs> not exactly. I, I told MJ and Liz. What? You told your girlfriends before you told your aunt. Yes, yeah, sorry about that. Somehow I don't believe you. Wait, where are you going? Well, as you know now, I'm a busy guy, so I guess I can sleep when I die. Okay, see, saying stuff like that, that's not okay. <laughs> I know, but I do have things to do. I have to go to the Bugle to get my paycheck, and then I'm gonna see Liz. Oh, so you guys are coming over for dinner this evening? Um, no, tonight's a little bit different, actually. Um, I guess she's kind of been hiding me from her dad, so tonight's the night when I finally get to meet him. Oh, wow, that's big. Yeah. You know, I, I'm Spider-Man, but it's things like this that get me the most nervous. Well, um, good luck, and uh, be polite. Like, very polite. <laughs> but I'm off to the bugle first. Speaking of which, you know your boss, Mr. Jameson? He could definitely learn some manners. So, what time are you coming home at? Uh, 10. Uh, let's try for 9 30. Okay, but no promises. I'm just, uh, I'm here for my paycheck. Damn it! I can't. What do you want? My, my, my paycheck, Jonah? We're doing that online now. We're doing that shit online now. We do that online? Yeah. You couldn't have emailed me about that? You don't respond to your emails anyway. Uh, sometimes. Oh, for God's sake, sometimes. You don't! Yeah, you're right, I don't. Which you should! 
You're a child of the 21st century, for God's sake. Get with it. I tweet three times a day, at least sometimes four if I'm feeling zesty. Oh, okay, I'll, I'll follow you on Twitter. No, you won't. Now get out. Okay, before you go, I need something from you this week. What is it? I need you to bring me a bucket. And when I empty the bucket on my desk, I want 100 photographs with that weirdo Spider-Man. 200 even. But why would you want physical photographs? I mean, we're in the 21st century. Don't be a smart ass. You're going to pay for that. Uh, why do you want so many pictures of Spider-Man? Do you even have a phone? It's everywhere. Everyone in this cat is, is, is hating on this guy. Oh, because of the Harry Osborn incident. Oh, so you do know. I mean, I didn't think there was too much hate. I'm, I'm so busy, I don't even check. You work for a news publishing company for crying out loud. Do your job. But I mean, how can people be so sure that it was actually Spider-Man that killed Harry? Who else would it be? His dead dad? Also killed by Spider-Man. I know, I know. Look at all the hate mail Spider-Man is getting, for God's sake. Look at, look, look at this. Look at this. See, look at that. Wow. Man, that's, that's a lot of people. Yeah, and well-deserved hate, too. Oh, God, it's Betty. Yeah, what do you want? Time for my medicine. God almighty. Okay, just a minute. Jesus. Uh, do you need water? Water, for Christ's sake! I got the water. God damn it. What the fuck was that? I came as soon as I could, Father. Bring me some water. Here, drink. This is so painful. You made me like this. Why do you say these things? You have been ill for many years. I do everything for you. Where do you want to go? You can't walk. With God. Why do you say such foolish things? I learned everything from you. How to hunt. How to kill. How to survive. How to be a man. Without you, I would be a murderer. Tio Bitsa, you are the murderer! You killed my mother! Она собиралась собрать тебя обратно в Россию. Я не мог бы ей этого позволить. Ты был бы убит! You were my only son. I was so young. What's going on? Anna, where are you? Anna? What's going on? Yes, yes. Come on. What are you doing? I'm going to leave. Wait, where are you going? What's going on? I'm going to Russia. What's that? I can't do that anymore. I can't, I can't. What? What you can't do? What I can't do? Anna! I can't live like this! 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 И, и есть этих Дорогая. белок и зайцев, мы что, джипси, Дорогая, да? мы только что приехали в Америку, я тебя умоляю, послушай, все будет нормально. Чтобы жить для лучшей для жизни. Для лучшей жизни, да, все и... правильно. И вот это лучшая жизнь? Я, я найду работу, здесь Какую недалеко, работу? На, на, на заводе. Анна, подожди, послушай. Как, и когда? Когда он опять в лед? Это был несчастный случай. Мне не нравится, когда ты его туда забираешь. Он почти умер. Что ты напоминаешь обо всем? Это был несчастный случай. Да, нет, ты знаешь. В чем ты говоришь? Я больше не могу так жить. Анна, послушай. You're not gonna take my son. Да, я его забираю, потому что так 
Все, я не могу. Нет, ты не вернешься сюда! Папа! Иди сюда! Энна! Все, все! Оставь вещи! Нет, оставь нет! Дай мне! Дай мне! Не трогай мои вещи! Не трогай мои вещи! Конечно, я его собираю! Все, мы уезжаем! Нет, она... Я не могу вернуться! Стой! 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 Я тебя прошу! Нет, ты не заберешь моего сына больше, я тебе сказал! Я убил ее по уважительной причине. But you, Sergey, you kill for fun. I kill for honor. No, you have changed. Your eyes, they are empty. Then help me, father. Tell me, what do I need to do? I want to live in peace with myself. Then stop the violence. У нас есть все это состояние. Не нужно больше крови. But I feel this darkness, Papa. It lingers in my soul. Darkness? Это все в твоей голове. But I can't. It, it's in my blood. It's in my soul. It's in my heart. Why do you feel this way? The Spider-Man. He's ruining my name. He almost had me killed. The Spider-Man? Who is this Spider-Man? An evil man, set out to destroy me. My name, my reputation. Why is this so important? Because, Papa, he's ruining everything I stood for. Everything that we stood for. This is true? Yes. Peace will come once the Spider-Man is dead. Then do what you must. But remember, You are not Kraven the Hunter. You are Sergei, my son. <coughs> Papa, what's wrong? <coughs> <coughs> Papa, you're bleeding. I cannot walk, go any longer. The pain. What do you want me to do? Take you to the hospital? Give me my pills. Wait, what? <coughs> Give me my pills! What pills? Give me my pills now! Okay. <sighs> Morphine? Yes. But why, Papa? Just give them to me. Okay, okay. Here. Give me all. Okay, here, take them. God, forgive me, the prostitute man you book. Help me! Son, come here, come here. Papa, what is it? You are strong. You are smart. You are a crave enough. But I want you to listen to me. There has always have been two bears fighting over your heart. The good bear and the bad one. Yes, Papa, but which one wins? The one you fit. You were always wise, Father. Rest in eternal sleep.
Sergi. You learn fast, my son. <laughs> Spasibo, papa. Uh-uh, uh-uh, on English. On English, my son. Thank you, papa. Here you go, look at the muscles. <laughs> Oh, I'm just trying to make you proud, Papa. You are making me proud, <laughs> my son. Come here. Come here. Now we live in America, Sergey. Ah. We have to learn their life of style. But what about the people in Russia? There is nobody left. Only you and me. But Sergey, I feel hungry. You? Yes, Papa, I'm hungry. Let's go to eat. Oh yeah, I'm gonna beat you home to it. Let's go. <laughs> Peter Parker, I am coming for you. we've met before. Clearly not. Um, I just... Uh, Are you my daughter's math tutor? No. Well then? But I could be. What? Are you trying to convert my religion? No, no sir, no. no. Sell me Girl Scout cookies? That's not what I'm here for, sir. But what the hell do you want? Speak up, son! Um, I'll let you know if you let me in. Fine. Hi. Dad, this is Peter. Really? Mm -hmm. This is THE Peter? THE Peter. I thought it'd be a little bit more buff than that. Dad, he's stronger than he looks. Where are you going to school, Peter? Um, Empire State University. I mean, I, I'm going there next year. I'm, I go to your daughter's school right now. So how do you feel about Liz going to LA? Oh, I'm sad about it. Not as sad as I am. I'm going to miss Dad? you. Yes, oh, I am. Dad, yes, stop. I am. Stop, Dad. Okay. I just love you so much. Yeah, just a little too much. Why don't we go into the kitchen where we can sit down and have a conversation, Peter? Sure. Sure. Okay. How old are you? Where do you live? Do you got a job? Do you got a family? Under or over 150 pounds? Shoe size? How tall are you? Five, nine. With or without shoes? Are you a virgin? Okay, I think we're going upstairs now, Dad, so... <laughs> okay, all right, Peter, you pass the test. You two have fun. Oh, no, no, wait, wait. Do not have fun. You know, I'm really sorry about my dad. He's just so overprotective ever since I've dated Flash. I would be too. Okay, so what happened today? Tell me. About that. Okay, so I was hiding something from you? What? Tell me, Peter. It's, it's nothing crazy. You just have to promise me that you're not going to be mad and freak out. And how am I going to promise that? Please. Fine. I promise I won't be mad. Okay, so that uh, Craven guy that attacked our school? Mm -hmm. uh, this morning I fought him. What? Peter, why don't you tell me that? Well, you, I, you know. You were already stressed about the test, being late for that, and, you know, I didn't lie about sleeping in. I did sleep in. Peter, I'm not mad that it happened. I'm mad you didn't tell me. I know, but it's a long story. I slept in, I woke up, I was on the subway, then I ran into Flash. Ew. And then the whole Craven thing happened. But he was a piece of cake to beat anyway. Okay, but at school... Yeah, he, he showed up at school. I don't know how he found out, but he was stronger in, like, in a few hours. So I don't know if he took the Oscorp serum. Uh, you know, I, I'm pretty sure that's what it is because I don't think he's necessarily smart to develop one himself. Just what we were talking about earlier. Yeah, and I'm thinking maybe I should take the black suit again just to compete. No, Peter, you're not taking that alien substance. The last time you told me it made you depressed. When you have all this power, you become depressed regardless. Peter, stick to your guns. That's what you're good at. The scary thing is, I don't know what it is he wants. Mm. Uh, it's my boss. I'm not gonna get it. Mm. Three, four rings. Ah, 
Shit, that boy never answers the phone when I'm on him. Okay. <laughs> Must be a wrong number or something, huh? Give the damn. Anyway. for me. about this so help me god i'll hang you by your balls out the window oh, okay i won't tell anyone but i came here just to talk about a couple things no privacy at all around here do you have five what? minutes do you have five minutes five minutes no way you've got 30 seconds okay okay time's up get the hell out of here i'll make it quick okay uh, i'm sorry Christ. Um, I just, did you get the, the photos that I sent you? The Kraven and Spider-Man? Yeah, 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 Spider-Man yeah, 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 it's full of bullshit. Uh, okay. Who's this Craven guy anyway? He's, I don't know, I, I, I'm not really too... I don't know. I don't know, I guess he's one of Spider-Man's villains, I don't, I don't know. But that's not the reason... Spider-Man is a villain! No, he's Where not. He, he's protecting everyone. He's protecting the city from, uh, from Craven and his, his rivals uh, and everything. But that's not why I'm here. Listen. What the hell? Why, why are you here? If you saw the photos, they're pretty high quality. They're doing pretty well. I was wondering, I was wondering if I can get a raise. What? A raise? A raise? Yeah, I just think it's only fair. You want a raise? Yeah. Cause you I'm want a raise? Ah! Oh, he wants a raise for what? I mean, I've been working. Tell me for what? Uh, listen. I've been working for the Daily Bugle for four years now, and I've yet to see any type of raise. But Robert from Payroll, he's been only working here for three months and he got a raise. Who the hell is this Robert guy? Uh, he's from Payroll. Maybe he deserves it. Have you ever thought of that? What have you been doing for four years? I just see you standing around all the time. Mr. Jameson. Yeah? What if I can promise you I can bring Spider-Man here to meet you next oh, week? Oh, I don't believe a thing you're saying. What are you talking I, about? I, I can promise you. I, I know him. I, I didn't want to say it in front of people. You know Spider-Man. Yes. What if I can promise you that I can bring Spider-Man here? I don't that, believe it. Hold on. You've heard the story about the early bird gets the worm. I, I understand that, but... What, can, yes, can stop you, interrupting! Can, I, can we just go back to my pay? No, stop what interrupting. What if I told you I could bring Spider-Man here? We already here? made a deal. I could bring Spider-Man here. Twice the work, half the pay. We already made a deal. Now listen up. If you can bring Spider-Man here, yeah. so that he's in my office, yeah. I need him face to face. Face to face. Man to man. Yep. So I can punch him in the mouth. No, don't punch him. He's saving, the, he's saving our city. He's a weirdo. He's not a weirdo, but... That's besides the point. He's destroying the freaking city. Accidents everywhere. Spider webs, cobwebs everywhere, for Christ's sake. I, I can get him here. Ah, you can get him here. But, uh, but if you bring him here, I'll get to the raise you want, and I'll get you a date with Betty Brandt. Uh, I think she's married, sir. She's married? Yeah. Who gives a shit? Okay, okay. All right. 50 bucks an hour? 50 bucks oh, an hour. Sir, thank you so much, what? sir. I appreciate it. Get out. Oh, get out. Get out. Okay. Get your fire. <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> you, the best. You! What the hell? What the hell? Where is Peter Parker? Tell me! The fight barbarian! Shut up, you old man! Shut your chest and son of it! Where is Peter Parker? I can't get a son of a bitch there! Jesus! Come on! 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 Come on
Thanks, you old bastard. You son of a bitch! You're not gonna get away with that. Oh! Oh, shit! Oh. You know, I, I just wish that we had more time together. I know you're telling me. Like, I don't think that I have, you know, the same amount of experience at relationships that you have, but I, I don't think I've felt this way about anyone. I can say the same. Remember when uh, you first talked to me? <laughs> don't remind me. So awkward. Why did you do that? You were just in such a tough spot with her and passing and everything. I just wanted to be the one person to make you feel better. Well, it worked. And I needed that. I mean, besides Aunt May, I had nobody. And Mary Jane's never going to forgive me for killing Harry. I'll never forgive myself. Well, just leave the past in the past. Aren't you glad things didn't work out with MJ? Thrilled. <laughs> I think I should get going. Hey, it's Peter. Uh, just leave a message. Uh, okay, bye. Please leave a message after the tone. Oh, hey, Peter, it's May. Um, it is way after 10 o'clock, and you were supposed to be home. I know you were out with Liz, um, but she's a very studious girl, and uh, I think that you should be home soon. I don't want you to be a bad influence on her, because I know then that would make a bad influence on yourself. So I would really like you to come home soon, because I have to get up early in the morning. And um, by the way, your lunch, I gotta go. Peter, I'm glad you're home. Um, I just left you a message. Can you bring me in a mop, please? Looking for this? Good night, Mr. Allen. Mm. Oh, it's not too cold. See you tomorrow? Yes, on time for once. On time, yeah. You don't know who I am? I was born in Volograd, Russia, during the revolution. Nothing scares me. <laughs> I am the greatest hunter in all of the world. I have wrestled with the gorillas of Kenya, and I've killed the hippos of the Nile with my bare hands. I have so much power, I could kill you in one breath. Spider-Man stands no chance. For I have a special spot for him on my wall. For when I have his head stuffed above my fireplace. <laughs> You're crazy. Crazy? I am Craven, the hunter! No, just crazy. Oh, good. Look, I'm on time for once. So glad you could join us. Welcome to the party. Thanks for inviting me. 
This place is a lot more luxurious than I expected. I'm glad you like it. It would look so much better with your head on the wall. <sighs> no. Look, I'm all out of jokes, all right? Let's just get this going. <sighs> You're no match for my skills. What skill is that? Beard grooming? Keep the jokes coming. It will make cutting out your tongue so much sweeter. You have more skill than I thought. Don't flatter me, I might start liking it. Makes it all that much better. When I rip your head from your body. By all means, give me your best shot! Run! But Peter, do you need my help? No, just go! I'm surprised you've lasted this long, Spider-Man. Just give it up, man. Why are you doing this? Go hunt another lion or something. <laughs> Take a long, deep breath in, Spider-Man. It will be your last. Well, if you really want to do this, it ends here. <laughs> By the blood, it tastes good. Your days of killing are over. Admit it. 
No, no. My whole life has been about the hunt. It gives me power. It gives me strength. It gives me a purpose to live. Just to throw it all away. It would mean... Baby, what are you doing? See you in hell, Spider-Man. No! Are you going to kill me? How can I kill you? How can you kill yourself? Craven, over the past few years of me doing this, I've truly learned the value of living. I suggest you do the same. You know, I'll never understand why people like you do the things that they do. But I'll try for just a second. You do it for a feeling of power, self-worth, ego, dominance. But are all those feelings truly worth the expense of the countless lives of others? I'm going to give you some advice today, Craven. And I, I truly hope you take it to heart. Because you're clearly trying to fill a void. So find another way to fill that void. And this time, when you do, make sure no one else has to die. Because I know that I can't let anyone else die. It's not a good feeling. And I hope you regret that feeling too. Well done, Spider-Man. And the Oscar goes to... It appears the city of New York has turned a new leaf as people are in the streets celebrating the now friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. Last night, Spider-Man saved an unidentified hostage from a Russian criminal, Sergei Kravinov, who also goes by the name Craven the Hunter. Yo, Spider-Man, if you're looking for a psychic, you know what I'm saying, a black psychic, I can, yo, oh, yo, I'm good for that, yo. Just hit me up. It's clear to me now that he is out there trying to protect us, and any incidents that occurred in the past were tragic accidents. Support we owe it to him to understand that not every day can be a win. He should be in jail. He's a menace. I've always known that Spider Man was a good guy, so I mean, I. You're fired! Hey, what do you think of Spider Man? Oh, I love him. Love him. Love him. Have you always thought like this? Uh, not so much yesterday, but uh, it's growing on me, just like they say, eh? Spiders grow. Yeah, Liz, yeah, I'll, I'll be there in about 20 minutes. Sound good? Okay, see ya. Peter! Hey! Hey, man. What's going on? Guess what? I just got home from work, and everybody at the hospital is talking about Spider-Man. Check this out. Really? Yeah, like... Now let's watch as the people of New York celebrate Spider-Man. <laughs> Isn't that cool? My nephew's a hero. Congrats on what you're infamous to famous. Thanks, Boo. 
everything's finally starting to work out. Yeah, and right when school's ending. I mean, what well, weird timing. I know. I'm gonna miss you. I'm gonna miss you too, Peter. I wish I could come with you. You know, I wish you could come too, because I got so many online friends that would kill me for leaving New York. Hey, if they threaten to kill you, Spider-Man's gonna have a word with them. <laughs> Look, I get that. It's just, out of all the cities I could have been born in, I was born in the city of Broadway. And this opportunity in LA is just way too good to pass up. I get that. I would come with you, but you know, I feel like New York is finally starting to recognize me as a hero, and I can't abandon the city now. I get that too. There's something beautiful about goodbyes. What do you mean? It just brings a feeling of uncertainty. You don't know what's going to happen in the future, you're nervous, but you're excited too. Uncle Ben really taught you a lot. Oh, Uncle Ben didn't tell me that. It's all from the heart, I guess. <laughs> you know, I guess life experience really is the best possible teacher. I mean, you taught me a lot too, Peter. So I heard you're starting to like Spider-Man ever since he stopped that Craven guy. So... I never said that! I still think he's a bloody menace. But listen, I'm a friend of Spider-Man, like I said. Oh yeah, right. I have a surprise for you, sir. Spidey! Holy shit! Hoffman, you see this? Yeah, I do, this sir. Spider-Man, for God's sake. <laughs> Spider-Man, I'm your great fan, buddy. Oh, good to hear. My God, good to see him. Hoffman, take some pictures here uh, of me and my best buddy. Okay, I don't have my camera, but I'll take a photo off my phone. What are you talking about? Are you ready? Uh -huh. Three, two, one, perfect. Oh, I want those on the front page tomorrow. Either you or Peter can do it. Sounds good. Okay? Sir. Yep. Done. All right. Spider-Man. Thanks for swinging by. <laughs> <laughs> ah. <laughs> Sir, it was good. That was really good. That's a good one. That was good. <laughs> <laughs> Oh boy, I make the jokes around here, see? I can tell. Yeah, you know, I heard that you were maybe starting to grow somewhat of a liking to me, potentially. So, you know, I thought I'd come by and the Daily Bugle here really makes or breaks my reputation, so I think it'd be healthy to keep a good relationship between us. Peter! What the hell are you doing in a Spider-Man costume? No, I mean, what, what, what are you talking about? It's not me, man. Bloody hell. This no, is Peter! No, it's not, it's not. Oh my gosh! He does sound like Peter. Uh, surprise! It's me, Peter, in this really accurate replica Spider-Man costume. Hawkman, delete those pictures! No, 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 uh, front page, right? No, delete those pictures, the guy's a phony! Oh my God. Whoa, Peter, the suit looks what? so real! Where'd you get it? Uh, yeah, it's got it from like a black market website, pretty greasy, suitmakerstudios.china.org. I wouldn't look into it if I were you. But I, I kind of want one. Oh, well, I mean... Maybe I could hook you guys up.
Yo, is that a Pentax? Uh, yeah, it is. That's crazy. My uh, my grandfather actually taught me how to shoot on one of those things. Oh no way! My uncle taught me. It's been a while since I've seen one of those. You were in that orientation just now, yeah? Yeah, I saw you were too. What'd you think? I mean, I got accepted at NYU, but I like the vibe here a lot better. Oh, okay. Like the resources and stuff. The girls. True. <laughs> yeah, I mean, resources are one thing, but if you're a genius, you're a genius. And here you are, so I guess you're a genius. I mean, you said it, not me. <laughs> yeah, the, the photos, they've been kind of coming out kind of dark, and so I usually have to brighten them, but I guess that's the appeal of an, like, an old film camera. Uh, well, I mean, you should be able to get the proper exposure. Um, do you mind if I have a look at your settings? Uh, yeah, sure. I'll show you an example of some of the photos I have. I think I have some in my backpack. Cool. Your aperture is way too small. There you go. Uh, what's your name? Eddie. Peter. Oh. Um. Uh, well, here's your camera. I guess I'll see you tomorrow then, Eddie? Uh, yeah. Okay, cool. All right. Cool. All right.